Hello guys, welcome to Season with Love, y'all. I'm Casey, this is my kitchen. I'm excited today, y'all. We doing something very special today. We doing another episode of my summer salad series today. And today we doing seafood salad, y'all. I know y'all saw it in the title. So, we doing seafood salad, but we doing this for a cookout of 50 people. Okay, y'all? Doing this for 50 people. I'm going to serve them in these containers when we finish getting it together. You know what I'm saying? But without further ado, let's go over these ingredients. What you're going to need to make Season With Love seafood salad, y'all. First, you're going to need elbow macaroni because this is a seafood pasta salad. You're going to need some macaroni noodles. Use whatever noodles you like. I'm using macaroni noodles. You're going to need some cooked shrimp or cook your own shrimp. I got medium cooked shrimp. This is a 53.68 per 12 ounces. This is 12 ounces. I got two bags of those. Remember, we're doing this for 50 people. I got some mayonnaise, some good mayonnaise. Hellman's or Duke, whatever you choose. I got some fresh parsley here. I got about three pounds of imitation crab meat, y'all. That's going in there. I got that lump crab meat, the real crab meat, okay? I'm using a chicken of the sea lump and a bumblebee lump because it's what I had in my pantry. I got a couple of cans of tuna. I got some dry parsley, onion powder, garlic powder, seasoning salt. I'm using adobo. You can use lorries. Definitely need that Old Bay seasoning, y'all. I got some sweet pickle relish here. And I got some celery over here on the side. I'm going to put a couple of spokes of celery. I got a red onion. You can use white or sweet or whatever you choose. I got a green bell pepper and a red bell pepper, y'all. And I'm also going to go out in the garden and cut some green onions from my uh, scallion bush, okay? From my scallion plant. And uh, so, y'all, stay tuned on Season with Love. We're making seafood salad, y'all, for our summer salad series. Stay tuned. I'm going to get these veggies chopped up for y'all and put these noodles on the boil. And we gonna meet, I'm going to meet y'all right back here when we get ready to put everything together. All right, guys, we got everything prepped and ready. We ready to get started, okay? This is Season with Love, y'all. We making seafood salad for our summer salad series. Now, we catering this for a cookout, okay? So, uh, I'm going to put on some gloves. Usually, I don't wear gloves in my own kitchen. All right, you guys, so we mixing in this aluminum foil you pan. I got two pounds of cooked macaroni okay try not to overcook your pasta now I boil this and let it cool and get this in here okay all right you have to get into this salad with your hands here now okay now we just gonna start adding our ingredients to this macaroni okay we're going to get in here with all our vegetables. We got celery. We got red bell pepper. And we got red onion. We're going to get that in here. Okay. Uh-huh, y'all. Looking good. See, that's just the right amount for this amount of salad. See, it's looking beautiful. Now we're gonna get our crab meat up in here. We got three pounds of imitation crab meat going in, y'all. Three pounds of imitation crab meat that I've cut and prepped for the salad. Okay. Get all that in there. Mix that up evenly. Ooh, I hope our pan is big enough, y'all. This is why we gotta get in here with our hands because our pan, you know, I don't think there's no pan or bowl big enough that I have to mix this amount of salad in. So we're going to do it. We're going to do the best we could, y'all. Get in here and mix it up. So now we're going to go on with our, with our shrimp. Now I left my shrimp whole, but you guys can uh, cut your shrimp up if you like. These are uh, small shrimp. I took the tail off. Okay. Sometimes I'll leave the tail on. 
Well, people complain about the tails being in there because they can't get greedy with it, okay? So we got our uh, shrimp in there. Okay. Now I'm going to go in with this tuna. I got a couple of cans of tuna going in, y'all. A couple of cans of tuna. So y'all stay tuned. I'm going to try to distribute everything evenly and get back with you. All right, y'all. I managed to get all that tuna mixed in. Now I'm going to go in with the lump crab meat, okay? Going in with that lump crab meat. We got two nice cans of that lump crab meat. Okay. Get it all up out of there. Oh, this smells amazing, you guys. So now, with this, I'm going to give these gloves a quick rinse. You can't wash your gloves, okay? <laughs> you can wash the gloves. Now I'm going to dry them off real quick so that I can get over here to my seasonings. Now I want to add plenty of dry parsley to this. I got some fresh parsley, but I'm going to put that on at the end. Okay, this I want going inside. I'm going to put a little garlic powder, you guys. Okay, it's a lot of salad. Don't be scared to season. Put some onion powder. Okay. You know we gotta have that obey, the seafood salad. Get you enough of that obey in there, okay? Okay. We're gonna go in with our sweet relish. Cause this is seafood pasta salad. If I was making just straight seafood salad with just the seafood and a, a mayonnaise based seafood salad, I would not put relish in there and I would not put my eggs in here because this i'm gonna add boiled eggs to this too guys okay y'all stay tuned Stop it. i should have put my eggs in first but it's never too late so let me put this spoon down spoon, spoon. i'm gonna put some eggs in here y'all go ahead and get some eggs in here a couple of eggs a lot of people don't put eggs in their seafood salad. I don't put eggs in my seafood salad, but I do put eggs in my seafood pasta salad, y'all. All right, guys, we're going to get all this mixed in. Like I was saying, a lot of people don't put eggs in their seafood salad, but this is seafood pasta salad. If I was making straight seafood salad, I would not put eggs. I would not put bell peppers. I would not put sweet relish. Okay, I would not put a lot of stuff that I put in my seafood macaroni salad, but this is seafood pasta salad. Okay, seafood macaroni salad. Mm. I'm gonna try to get this mixed in, y'all. Stay tuned. Okay, get all this mixed in for y'all, and meet y'all back here. Okay, stay tuned on season with love. We making seafood salad for our summer salad series, y'all. Ooh wee! Look like we're gonna have to put this in two pans. So now we got this in two separate pans. We're gonna get this mixed up, okay? It was way too much for one pan. I added a little extra seasoning to each pan, a little extra relish, and a little extra uh, mayo, okay? Now we're gonna start mixing. I'm also gonna put some mustard in here. I ain't got my mustard out. I do like the twang that that mustard give it, okay? And a little bit of sugar too, y'all. So I got all that crab meat and everything up in here. Oh yeah, that's looking good, y'all. And we're gonna put everything back together once we get it all mixed up in here, okay? We're gonna put everything back together once we get everything mixed and blended. Y'all stay tuned on Season With Love. I'm gonna get all this mixed up and I'm gonna get back with y'all, okay? All right, guys, we got it all mixed up. Everything is mixed up good, it's mixed up good, y'all. We, we, fit, we mix it in two pans and then we put it all in one pan. Because right now, I'm going to distribute it into these containers I got over here. Okay? Remember, we're doing this for a cookout. So, they want them in these little containers. So, that's what we're doing. I'm going to finish this off with a little bit of parsley. I mean, uh, <laughs> with some paprika and some parsley, y'all. Okay? Ooh-wee, y'all. It's that seafood salad, y'all. 
my summer series. Season with love, y'all. My summer salad series, y'all. Hmm. Oh my goodness, y'all. This is looks amazing. Y'all like what I'm doing in these videos? Give me a thumbs up. Like, share, and subscribe to Season with Love, y'all. Y'all stay tuned to see this plate and see some clips of this cookout on Season with Love, y'all. Y'all know I'm going to hit y'all with a couple of pics at the end of the video. Y'all, thanks for watching. God bless.